Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to use differential optical absorption spectroscopy or DOAS technique in several applications in different markets. DOAS is a technique that is used to monitor pollutants in the atmospheric air. This form of spectroscopy is often used in continuous emission monitoring systems or SAMs. In this first example we show you how to measure car emissions. To measure DOAS it is required to measure small particles. To do this a longer part length is required as you can see on the example image. The longer part length is needed to gather as much particles as possible. Because of the larger part length we need to reduce low light levels and environmental light as much as possible. In this example we use a near infrared spectrometer with a halogen light source. The halogen light source is used with a collimating lens to create a parallel light beam. On the other side another collimating lens focused the light into the fiber optic cable which is connected to the spectrometer. The data from the spectrometer will be analyzed by using software. The combination of products you use in your setup depends on your measurement. The products we used in this example for measuring the car emissions are the near infrared spectrometer, two collimating lenses and one halogen light source. The next example is focused on the industrial emission. Industrial gas emissions have contributed enormously to the air pollution globally and getting monitored continuously all over the world. By monitoring SAMs or continuous emission monitoring systems, we use DOAS technique. These systems monitor the concentration of industrial gases and suspended particles emitted from air pollution sources. UV spectrometers are integrated to the SAMs used for calculation the absorption of sulfur oxides and nitrogen. Avanta spectrometers have high demands regarding stray light levels, optical resolution, stability and sensitivity, which makes them perfect for integration into SAMs. In the next example, I'll explain how to use DOAS technique to detect gas leaks. When a gas leak appears, it is necessary to detect this as fast as possible, even for low concentration. We often see that the measurements take place above pipelines to have the closest distance when a leak appears. After detection, the IO signals from the spectrometer can be used to enable a warning system. The Ethernet functionality is very useful to integrate the system on site and control it remotely on distance. If you want to know more about DOAS or other techniques, please visit our website. If you have some questions, don't hesitate to contact us. For now, thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next videos.